Hey guys, it's K Gaming, and welcome to a small game called Fallout Equestria What Remains, or Fallout Equestria Remains. So I am a brony, as some of you may know, and I kind of wore some pony shirts in a couple of my videos before, but this came up and it looks quite interesting, so we're going to do new game. So, let's create our characters. So, let's see, what color do we want? Let's go with darker blue. Primary main color, we can design a hair design. I think that was cool. Pink. Secondary color. Yes. Purple. I said no secondary colors. I just found my spring collection. I said too much. Uh, it's really yellow for the eyes. And the magical aura, we're gonna go with pink. Pink. Perfect. And your name shall be. Lady Midnight. Lady Midnight. Uh, skip. We live once. Fast level up. Uh, we're gonna go slow. We're just gonna take this test. In. Okay. Once upon a time in the magical land of Equestria, there came an era when the idols of friendship gave way to envy, selfishness, greed, and cruelty. The great war of natural resources broke out, in which there were no winners. A magical spark struck by pony hooves quickly raged out of control and turned into flames that engulfed the whole co continent. Dragon fire and black magic turned into destructive weapons, almost ending all life on the planet. Soil, water, and air became poisoned from radiation. Cities were destroyed, civilizations collapsed, for opponents and their enemies were almost wiped out the face of the earth. Apocalypse predicted by insane prophets, prophets whom almost no one believed until the last day finally had come. But it was not the end yet. Many ponies survived, some hiding in a huge underground shelter stables, others somehow adapting to new conditions. Apocalypse was just a prologue for another bloody chapter of pony history. On the scorched and poisoned wasteland, violence and cruelty became not just permissible, now they were means to survive. Since that day, the last day of former Equestria, about 200 years have passed. Your journey begins. What happened? Where am I? I need to get up. Come on, move, pony lady. Come on. I'd better get going. Put A or D to move left and right. Cool. Cool, cool. Face bar to jump. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's a, this is awesome. Okay, let's see. Crawly, 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 nightshade. So, check various containers that you encounter during your journey. This walk cabinet probably contains something essential. Come closer. Oh, gear. Cool. Hello. Cool cogwheels. Awesome. Caps. 21. Ooh, yay. All the good caps. Get up, my dear. Up, my dear. Cool. What is this way? Hello? Yep, yeah, nope. Can I just go upstairs? Yes, please. <laughs> I can't go any higher. Phew. Yay! Cog wheels. Get up, my sweet. Down the ladder, let's go. I don't like this. Attention, unknown signal detected. Decoding. Signal decoded. Pip buck signature identified. Connection established. Internationalizing systems. Welcome, new user. This is the emergency rescue system by the Ministry of Arcane Sciences. You were fully, you successfully registered in the system and cannot access all its privileges. 
in case of critical hazards to your life such as sudden zebra attacks, terror action, mega spill explosion, or falling from a staircase, you will be automatically teleported to safety to the nearest available MAS, the Ministry of Admissions, Ministry, uh, uh, Ministry of Administrative Sciences. You will get you will get necessary medical treatment there. Warning: The system is current beta. Some minor errors and malfunctions may exist. Thank you for your patience. The new mission added: to exit. Press tab on your pit block. Oh, cool skills, perks. I don't have enough, enough points yet. Oh, this is cool. Oh, maybe I have to use this thing. Hello? Story information menu. Yup. Intruder, a quite useful tool that can help you open simple locks. Try it on some, some lock chest. If the lock doesn't feel the first, don't worry, try it again. Tool can be used to open as both a weapon and breaking various objects. With you, can attack enemies, break open doors, and break through fragile walls. You can also crack open chests and other containers uh, when lock picking and a screw driving fails both loot. Oh, we're going this way. That's the fragile walls. I'm gonna shine my kids. Bleh. Come on, get your ass over here. I swoosh you. Charging pistol is a lucky prize. It belongs to a variety of magical energy weapons. It does not require batteries. It charges itself restored. Up. So 
instructions for using this. Cool. Ah. Gotta keep trying. Oh no, I can't jump over this. And this. I gotta get enough speed. Oh, there's rarity. <laughs> I was close. It seems there's light coming from the right that's probably an exit. And the left is darkness. I should head towards the exit. Or I should explore the catacombs first. You have history reached the exit and are awarded a level pop. With each level up, you receive skill points and abilities. Use them to improve your skill with the pit buck. Let's see what it allows. Like. Barter. Aw, oh, I like barter points. How many points do I have? Yeah, we're gonna work on bartering right now. Suddenly your pit bar turns itself on. It's a screen and usual interface. It's replaced by a series of symbols forming words and sentences. You don't understand what's going on, but standard pit boy software cannot do that, and you're well aware of this. Greetings, Chosen 25. Lady Midnight, I'm your mentor. My task is to direct you, your actions and point the way. What? What is this now? Who is talking to me? And how can I answer you? Now you probably would know. Now you'd probably like to know who I am and how, how I got into your pit buck and why you should trust me at all. The questions are more than reasonable and I, of course, will answer them as best I can. From now on, my, must, my identity must remain hidden. One thing I can say for sure is that I'm well acquainted and I'm by no means your enemy. These messages have been uploaded onto your pit buck in advance and are now being shown to you. And if I guess right what you are thinking now, no, there's no direct connection. You cannot respond or ask me questions. For now, as of why you should trust me, is your first and main argument. Pitbuck starts playing audio recording. Amazingly, you recognize your own voice. Hi, Lady Midnight from the future, says Lady Midnight. That is you, only a few days ago. I leave to you, I mean myself, this message to briefly explain the situation. Because some time ago you woke up in an unknown place in this strange blankness. Oh, and I'm in your memory. And so since I know that, that I, that is you, that is, you will not believe anyone but myself. Let me tell you this. 
I, that is, you, are entrusted with a very important mission. Relay important for the whole stable. And I, that is you, really think so. Persistently, you are under the influence of a spell blocking some of your memories. I, you, agree to undergo this spell absolutely voluntarily without the slightest concern or threat. I did it because it was necessary. Just trust me, that is yourself. For safety reasons, you will not remember where this is, where your home is, your friends, your family, but know that it's temporary. For now, just follow the instructions of the mentor. He will tell you what to do. He won't lie to you. I can assure you this. While you're on the mission, your codename is Chosen25. That is all good luck. The recording is a new mission appearing on the screen. Now that we have through the main quest, I'm sending you your instructions. Remember, it is in your best interest to execute them as soon as possible. Soon you will find your place in the equestrian wasteland. Observe extreme caution. According to my information, this place is very dangerous. You may encounter aggressive savage proteins and mutant animals. Areas contaminated with radiation also pose danger. Try to not make contact with the locals. You've chosen the right the next message when time comes. Remember your task is very important to all of us. Until next time, Jason 47 messages appear in the pop-up to the Max Memory Quest section. I remember my stable. I remember something vaguely. Ah! Memory spell. How could I agree to this? But it is surely worth my voice on the recording. And if so confident about this mentor, then there had to be a reason. In that case, I do have much of a choice. Either I will stay forever in this place or I will carry out the instructions of the mentor. And then we'll actually see what comes next. Chasing the rainbow. Up! Ah! So this is the Equestria Wasteland. It's so spacious. Oh, I feel dizzy. Pipbuck should have missions for me. Up. Okay, let's see. Oh, let's get back out of here. Let's go. Cool. Oh, we're in Ponyville. Oh, dear. Oh, yeah, this is definitely Ponyville. Hello? Down we go. Just get my pistol out. Ooh. How the hell do I get down? Oh, I might have to... Removed 
free food. Oh, Carney Christmas. Eh. Okay, yep, yeah, probably not the best idea to go down there, so we are just gonna head back upstairs. I've got a friggin' mole rat. I am good. Heading this way. Toward town? Wait, I think I saw some pony in there. E EFF marks a hostile target. Even if it's a pony, it is not too friendly. Still, should it should it attack first or perhaps at least start talking to it? Or hi, do you live here? I what? Who the hell are you? Hey, come here, right, pony. We're gonna have some fun. Crap! Ah! It's raping time. I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep. I died. It. Cool. We're gonna just avoid. Ow! What killed me? Go put a couple more bullets in that bitch's head. Even though I really don't want to, have to kill her. Let's read that rich. Mm. I don't really want to have to kill her, but okay. I don't think I have much of a choice. I'm trying to double jump and get away from you, son of a bitch. Forget I can double jump in this game. I can double jump higher when I hope. Not fucking easy. Do I have any health on me? Uh. Do I have any ammunition? Huh. 
coming. I killed the pony. No, whatever it was, the psycho did not too much love the pony. Keep trying. Cool. Try this. So I really don't want to have to deal with her. Why can I not stand? I'm close. Dear. Hi, my dear. Come here. I didn't know we were going to get that high. Ha! Sorry. Yeah, no, I'm good. We're just going to go this way. Let's 
Bye, guys. Well, I guess um, I could uh, let's do that. Let's go ahead and stick my crowbar on too. Crowbar. Right. Right. Oh, cool. I'll take all this shit. Thank you. Radiation. Sweet boy. Let's go this way. Let's see if I have any help. Joe, I don't want to go upstairs. I just want to leave. Cool. Let's go this way. No. No. Bad. Crowbar's strong as hell. Jesus. Cool. This way. Hello. Oh, oh. Couldn't keep an idea. Ah. Oh, we did. We did. I know exactly what I have to do. Come on, my dear. My dear, come on. Come 
Why do you not swim faster? We're going to die. Because you are dumb. To the fucking radiation. Woman! So close. I just want to get over this bridge. We just want to get over this fucking bridge. Hello, my little pony. What are you doing out here alone? Don't want to have fun with us. You want to play, huh? Well, then come closer. <gasps> Hi, friendo. Hey, you. Hey, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm a dumbass. Cool, thanks. Thank you, my friend. I can take that shotgun now. Thank you, dearie friendo. Hi. Hi. Hey, are you are you crazy or what walking alone here? I'm glad I just came. I'm glad I came just in time, otherwise I can't even imagine what these raiders were doing. Er, thanks for helping me, but I had everything under control. Yeah, right. I could see you're under control. One pony without armor and a normal weapon against a whole lot of scumbags. Ah, why are you looking at me like that? I'm sorry, I've never seen a Pegasus before. In our, I mean, in a place where I came from, there were no Pegasi at all. Ah, ah, I see. I reckon there are so many more of us in the wasteland. Wait, what place are you talking about? Well, I'm not a local. My home is far away. How far? Hold your horses. Let me guess. Are you from a stable? My word, you must be you must you must be from there. Ah, this funny costume. Yep, it's all clear. To tell you the truth, there are a few stables that have ponies with live ponies with them. That I rarely meet like ponies like that nowadays. You're right, but let's not talk now, okay? Let's go. So you're one of the locals, right? Well, you could say that. Nice to meet you. I'm Calamity. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm late in midnight. Listen, Clowny, unless it's too much for your trouble, could you show me the way to the nearest town or other settlement? Of course. I'll even accompany you. There's a cat nearby, the Pranchin' Pony. I'm sure you'll find everything you might need. Now tell me where you go. Let's go. Prancing Pony can't travel. Oh, cool. I can just cut, jump cut there. Well, we certainly got some somewhere. Look at... Looks like they're they're not gonna shoot me right away. I need to look around and ask some questions. Where am I? Oh, can I beat him? Bah, bah. Welcome to the clinic of Doctor Cephas. It's me for your information. Wide spectrum of medical service. Treatment of wounds, contusions, fractures, radiation sickness, and my special invasion, blood infection. Hi, Doc. I'm late at midnight. This place doesn't look like a clinic. Yet it is the best you can find in this area. When you're struck by a radar or bitten by a wild ghoul, this is sure happens sooner than later. You'll have nothing else left to do but come to me. Only then you'll be able to see the real value of this place. And why can't I just use healing potions? You're not very strong in medicine, are you? Healing potions, as you as you call them, are nothing more than potent repetitive drugs. They are serious. If you get a serious injury, say a fracture or concussion, your only chance of recovery is a good doctor with medical requirement required. Repo. What drugs? Reparative. Meaning regenerating. In short, your body always tries to recover to its normal state. 
curing only its own very guts and bruises and so on. Your repetitive drugs speed up the process several times, but if you are an injured in which the body cannot cope on its own, your potion won't be able to help you in any way. I see your pit buck. This device makes oh okay. god. Let's see on myself up. Doc, what about the strange robot standing in the corner? This is an all doc. Oh, I can take this. Cool. All right, guys. Well, I'm actually going to leave this episode of uh, main menu. We're going to just save it. I'm just going to save up the file. Save up. I'm just going to save up the memory side. Yes. All right, guys. Well, as I said, we're going to leave this episode of Fallout Equestria here. I had fun. I might come back to this. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. I was going to be treating Shorks and everything down below in the videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. Kerbam!